Hello viewers, in today's session we will be practicing important Indian economy MCQ with a short explanation in the context of national income in India. If you are new to our channel, we kindly invite you to subscribe for more helpful content and make sure that this session is set to. You can check out the previous session in the playlist. So let's get started. Which method is most commonly used to calculate national income in India? Correct answer, option D, value added method. The value added method is commonly used in India to calculate national income. It sums the value added by all sectors of the economy, agriculture, industry, and services to avoid double counting and provide a clear measure of economic contribution. Next question. Which organization is primarily responsible for the estimation of national income in India? Correct answer, National Statistical Office, NSO. The National Statistical Office, NSO, under the Ministry of Statistics and Program Implementation, MOSBI, is responsible for the estimation of national income in India, providing comprehensive statistical data and economic indicators. Next question, what does cross-national product, GNB, include that cross-domestic product, GDP does not. Correct answer is option A, income from foreign investment. Here, GNB includes GDP plus income earned by residents from overseas investment minus income earned within the domestic economy by foreign residents. It accounts for the net income for abroad, reflecting the economy strengthened of a country nationals. Next question, what does the term net national product, NNP, signify? Correct answer, option C, GNP minus depreciation. Net national product, NNP, is calculated by subtracting depreciation from cross national product, GNP. It represents the net value of goods and services produced by a nation after accounting for the wear and tear on capital goods. Next question. Which of the following is not included in the calculation of national income? Carrying on cell option A, transfer payments. Transfer payments such as pensions, scholarships, and unemployment benefits are not included in national income calculations because they are not payments for goods or services and do not reflect economic production. Next question, how is per capita income calculated? Correct answer, option A, national income divided by total population. Per capita income is calculated by dividing the national income by the total population of the country. It indicates the average income of a country's citizens and is used to assess the economic well-being of the population. Next question, which sector's contribution is measured in terms of cross value added GV at the best price? Correct answer is option T, all of the above. Here, cross value added GVM at the best price measures the value of goods and services produced in an economy by all sectors, including public administration, services, and manufacturing minus the cost of the inputs and raw materials. Next question, what does the term disposable personal income refer to? Correct answer option A, personal income minus personal taxes. Here, disposable in personal income is the amount of money that households have available for spending and saving after accounting for personal income taxes. It is a crucial indicator of consumer purchasing power and economy health. Next question, which concept represents the total market value of all final goods and services produced within a country in a specific period? Correct answer option C, cross domestic product, GDP. GDP measures the total market value of all final goods and services produced within a country in a specific period, reflecting the economy activity and performance within the domestic territory of the country. 
Here is the last question for today's session. What is the base year currently used for calculating GDP in India? Correct answer is option B, 2011 to 2012. The base year for calculating GDP in India is currently 2011 to 2012. The base year is periodically updated to reflect more accurate and current economic data, ensuring that GDP calculation remains relevant and reliable.